All right, guys, welcome to episode 127 of Dope Talk TV. It's your truly low key. Got John here with me, got the dogs put up. You already know how to fuck a rocket, man. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget, hit that like button, leave a comment, go down in the description, get yourself some merch, For tell real. a friend about it. You know what I'm saying? Light your blunt, light your J, pack your bomb, pack your bowl, get your dab rigs ready, get your edibles going. Whatever the fuck it is that you're doing, we rocking with it, all right? That us. But yeah, man, we're back with another one. It's a beautiful Thursday. How we feeling today, Johnny boy? How we feeling? How we feeling? Feeling good, feeling good. Fucking dripped out, dripped out today. Drip drop swag. Got the champion, you know what I mean? The shirt. Shout out to champion. I remember when that shit was in fucking Walmart, bro. Remember that shit? Yeah, I remember was in when Walmart. champion was not nothing and now it's like $60 shirts and shit. Yeah, so I mean, there's proof right there that you can come up from fucking nothing right there, man. You start at Walmart, even with a Walmart deal, that's still a lot of money, bro. But imagine like going like to like, now you're at, at Paxson, you're at fucking... Uh, Nike, you're at all these big ass establishments, you know what I mean? That's fucking crazy, dude. That's awesome. Yeah, bro, you got to start from the bottom, man. But listen, they did. They got themselves in the shelf, you know, and that's what's important, bro. Like, ultimately, like, it doesn't really matter where you start, it's about where you finish. Yep. So you can, you like, people were probably making fun of them for years for being at Walmart. Oh, Walmart, this, Walmart. Listen, bro, Walmart low key has some fresh shit. Yeah, Walmart, that's what like, the they've Shack actually, Gnosis They've shit. broken some, some, a couple of brands, you know what I'm saying? So it's like Walmart. I feel like they actually have people on the eye, you know, on the lookout for that type of shit. Yeah, like, bro. It's real like real. it's like oh man, this 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 product has an opportunity. You know what I mean? It's like oh mm-hmm. shit, all right, let's use them. But yeah, bro, I love Champion. They're comfortable. They even got fucking slides that match with it. You know? But, yeah, man. And that's the thing about it, bro. A lot of people, you know, they used to not like them, and then now they do. Yeah. And there's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. All right. That was the first thing I wanted to talk about is. That there's a difference between being a hypocrite and just changing your mind. You know what I'm saying? There's certain things that you feel a certain way about, and then five years go by, and you feel a different way about them. Like, you grow. You have different experiences. You look at it different. You're like, bro, it's just, it's life. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're not going to think the same way every fucking day for the rest of your life. Yeah, you're going to fucking, like, one day you may like the color fucking blue. One day you may like the color fucking red. And guess what? You That's can't do fact. nothing to fucking about it. That's facts, you know bro. What I mean? That's it's the like, way life goes. Well, man. I want a fucking Chevy. Well, I think Chevy's are trash. Facts. You know what I mean? And the next Yo. thing you know, it's like, it's a flip-flop, you know? Who knows? They come out with a fucking 2020 fucking badass Chevy, and then you want a fucking flip-flop. <laughs> yeah, you want a fucking Chevy, nigga. Like, yeah, the fuck? like, there's absolutely nothing wrong with that, bro. Nah, but Cody said that he wants to get rid of his. Yeah, he told me not to get one. Yeah. He's like, fuck that, bro. He had like 40,000 miles and had to get it fixed like twice already or some shit. Like, yeah, that's a that's weak ass, ass shit. Toby said it was something like, I don't even know. He said that's some trash ass truck or some shit bro, like that. I was I'm like, getting Damn. a Ford or a Ram. Yeah, one Ford, of the two. Ford or a Ram for Ford sure. Ford or a Ram. Fuck yeah. One of the two. No Chevys, man. And no offense to Chevy because I have a fucking Camaro and I love that Camaro. Yeah. It's barely ever broken down on me. You know what I'm saying? Knock on wood. Like, it's never really had big problems at all. It's, it's always been like tires and stuff like that. So I don't, I don't got nothing against Chevy, but when it comes to the trucks, yeah, F one fifties, man. Yeah, F one fifties are nice as fuck, and the I mean, Rams too. Um, both of those trucks. But yeah, I've been in a Silverado. My cousin has one. It was nice as fuck. It was like a 2016 or 17. Mm-hmm. But it was, it had like automatic fucking, like everything was nice, bro. Like everything was yeah. like the mirror. No, was they're fucking, not, listen, bro, guys, ultimately yeah. they're all, they're all, it's all about preference. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It really just comes down to preference. But when it, for me, when it comes to workload, when it comes to work, Fords are better. And then when it comes to like the interior, the newer Rams are better. The yeah. newer Rams are just, they got the interior. I think it has a bigger screen too. Like yeah, it's nicer. the The interior is just way nicer on the newer Rams, bro, than the F one fifties and stuff like that. But it's just preference, man. If mm. like if you don't care about none of that shit, like me, I'm personally on the type of guy like I want the luxury and I want to be able to use it as a truck too. You yeah, know what I'm saying? yeah, yeah. So I want like the nice interior with the nice screen, you know, leather seats and stuff like that. Yeah, that's what. But I because I, I want to enjoy my ride. Mm-hmm. You know, while I'm inside of it, I want to enjoy it. It's not a work truck, but yeah. if I need it to work, then I fucking it's yeah, gonna, yeah, I'll yeah. put it to I'll, work. I'll fucking haul some shit. You yeah, know what I mean? like Fuck facts, it. big facts. But, but yeah, yeah, man, you remember being a fucking kid, right? And you get caught fucking sneaking out. 
Yeah, I used to do that shit all the time, bro. <laughs> fucking my mom calling me, fucking calling my friends. You seen John? What the fuck? He fucking yeah, does. Bro. Oh, he out. He's gone. He they will be like, yo, your mom's calling me. I'm like, don't pick up. Don't pick up. Yeah, facts. Like, yo, everybody's ignoring their parents' calls. Now everybody's fucked. Everybody's parents are calling each other and shit. Like, oh, man, John's mom looking for fucking... John and Fact, shit, bro. Like, damn, bro. All these motherfuckers are pieces of shit. They're yeah. all out. Yeah, for real. They're all out. I remember the first time I fucking, uh, I skipped school. My mom got a phone call and she was just like, yo. And I remember I was at Justin's and JoJo, <laughs> he fucking, he was in the kitchen. We're in the garage smoking. So we didn't hear my mom at the front door. She fucking knocks on the door. God, JoJo's fucking, that was when Oli was, was up. You know, we had the house to ourselves the whole summer. So we're smoking <laughs> in the fucking house and shit. And JoJo op- opens up the door with a blunt. And he, like, fucking blows smoke in my mom's face. Like, hey. Wow. And she's just like, oh, is John here? <laughs> and he's just like. Disrespectful piece of shit. <laughs> That's what I want to say. Look at that. And I was just like, fuck. So I fucking went in there. And my mom was like, ah, what the fuck? Uh, you think you're fucking cool with these fucking losers? Yeah. You're a piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> and nah, man. But that was Barely, that was a long bro. time ago. That was fun times, man. Yeah, man. Getting caught sneaking out, bro. If you've never done it, you should try it. <laughs> yeah. But when we have kids, we're gonna be fucking pissed. I oh, know. They're not. Get, I'm gonna catch them before they sneak out. Yeah, they're gonna that, be fucking mad. They're gonna think like they're two times or like fucking triple fucking. Uh, what was I gonna say? Fucking. That. <laughs> <laughs> they're fucking. My dog is lit. <laughs> yeah, I'm bro. really high, bro. I took like two dubs. Nah, y'all don't understand. We already had dinner, so we got the itis, and we're smoking, so yeah. we're just fucking cool. I just cool, got man. a fucking big ass three sizes of fucking pizza, <laughs> breadstick, and a couple fucking chicken wings. A couple you know chicken mean? wings. Goddamn barbecue. I mean, this shit was going quick. The fuck? <laughs> in the picture, they look like they got. <laughs> in the they picture, make it look like it's a bunch of wings. Yo, I fucking hate that this shit, bro. It's like five nuggets. It's like five. <laughs> Yo, I hate that shit, bro. Fake ass advertisement. That's one thing that grinds my fucking gears, bro. Yeah, fact. Fight, bro. Don't, yo, listen. If it don't look like that in real life, don't make it look like that in the picture. <laughs> nah, for real. Just bro. fucking show the shitty ass shriveled up five nuggets. They just tell me that's what I'm getting, they, and I'll be as satisfied once I get that. They show, you know the, yeah. They show the fucking sizzle coming off the fucking <laughs> burger. You know, a little drip. Oh yeah, they show the little. That, the that shit's juicy as fuck. <laughs> the sprite is fresh. That shit's shit bubbling. <laughs> But when you get that motherfucker, that, <laughs> that shit is flatter than the fucking <laughs> Zypher Hills, bitch. That shit's fucking flat as hell. The burgers burn shit. Yeah. No juice on that motherfucker whatsoever. Fucking the people are rude as fuck. Yeah. Like, what the fuck? They don't want to be there and They're shit. Like, Yo, excuse like, me. What you want? It's like, uh, bitch, yeah. I'll fucking throw this whole tray on you. Bro, you, right now. you ask a fucking... <laughs> You ever see that guy that fucking goes through the drive thru and he fucking just like hands him a fucking like uncooked fucking item? And I'm like, hey, can you cook this shit for me? My house just got burned down. Wow. And like, I <laughs> told you to get the fuck on, bro. <laughs> And I was working there and you came with that bullshit. I'm like, nah, bro, you got to get the fuck on with that bullshit. There's some people that fucking cooked it. He's like, hey, can you just put this shit in the oven for like 15 minutes? Yeah, you (laughs) go to fucking 7-Eleven and try that shit. Yo, I'll be fucking pissed, bro. I'll be fucking pissed. I'll throw that wiener right in his fucking face. (laughs) the fuck out of here, bro. Nah, get the fuck out of here with that bullshit, bro. That's some trash. But that's how it goes. That's how it goes, man. But you know what's crazy, bro? We've all been in situations, right, where like you feeling a shorty, you meeting her. At a you know it's a party or it's yeah. like it's one of the party atmospheres. There's lights and shit. Those lights hit fucking different, bro. They make people look completely different. Facts. There's been plenty of times where you look at somebody and you're like, damn, she looks straight. You get a number, whatever. Then you look at her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In normal lights. Nah, in normal lights when them shits go <laughs> when on. When the bro. sun come out, when there's no disco lights, <laughs> there ain't no f- flashing lights on and off. So you're not sure it's a fifty-fifty chance. I think that shit chance. just makes you fucking blind. No, nah, it's you're a just fi- fucking half blind. So you don't know what the fuck is going on at night. You don't know what's going on. The night crawlers come out at night, so you gotta be careful. These motherfuckers, Thanks. they be hiding. You know what I mean? During the daytime, they be hiding, bro. But when at nighttime, bro, when that nighttime drop, when that moon come out. These night crawlers be coming out. They'd be like, uh, look, bro, you gotta watch out for the night crawlers, man. They get a hold of you. <laughs> they get a hold of you. Ah, and they won't damn bit on you. Just fucking burn your finger off. I almost burnt my shit. <laughs> nah, but yeah, man. Them party lights just make you look fucking different, guys. Be careful. <laughs> be careful, man. Bro, the disco lights, bro. I'm telling you, you're flashing on and off. That shit. Do, do, do. Lights going off and on. You're like, oh yeah. shit, yeah, yeah. She's cute from this angle. You get closer, bro. When the lights turn on. 
you got yo, you damn near ask her where her fucking friend went. Yeah, bro. That's how different she looked. You get up to her, you're like, yo, where's your friend that was just right here? Oh, it's you? Oh, my bad. No, nah, never mind. Nah, there's some there's some guys out there that I know, bro, that would hit an ogre, but the body of a guy. Oh, they don't. They'll hit an ogre. I know some guys that'll uh, hit a fucking ogre, period. But with a body of a guy. Like, them niggas Shrek are fucking, with a body. They'll hit a water buffalo. They wouldn't give a fuck <laughs> if that Henny is in them. <laughs> bro, I don't give a fuck, bro. They're hitting water buffaloes. They're hitting fucking all that shit. Nah, that's funny. That's funny. Now, there was a point in time in my life where I was just like... <laughs> You wouldn't give a fuck. Yeah, I was just like any nah. any hole is a trench in a time of war. Any time, nah, that wasn't me. That was that was my other buddy, bro. He would fucking fuck a water buffalo. He would fuck a fucking seahorse. Yeah, nah, <laughs> you wouldn't give a fuck. You know, everybody has that friend. Everybody has that friend. If there's a hole in the wall, bro, he's hitting. As soon as everybody leaves the room, <laughs> bro, baby, I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you all night. <laughs> all night, baby. All fucking night. Oh fucking a, bro! You remember when we used to play fucking uh, fucking manhunt? Listen, man, manhunt, bro, manhunt. We were fucking kids and shit. Fuck manhunt. The real reason for manhunt, guys, we're gonna disclose it right here, right now. We're not gonna play with you. We're not gonna bullshit with you. This yeah, is, you know what I'm saying? Dope talk TV. We speak facts. This is All what right? we do. So real life. I don't know about y'all, but manhunt for me meant. Getting my dick sucked. Yeah, like all right. <laughs> meet me behind Round the palm of applause, tree. All right, yeah. Meet me, meet yeah. Meet me over here in five minutes. You know what this I mean? is my partner. Me and her <laughs> gonna go hide over there. There's a bush. There's a tree. We'll play for thirty minutes. <laughs> we'll come out. Oh, you caught me. Oh, fuck. Oh, nah, whatever. I, I was the motherfucker. <laughs> That was not thinking about that. I was the yeah. motherfucker that was hiding, really, really you hiding. You were really hiding. Like, they really like, couldn't find me. Like, yo, y'all niggas will never find me bro, over here. Bro, three hours later, bro, they were like, yo, where's John at, bro? And I'm just still like, hiding. I'm the like, best. Hey. Yeah, I'm the I'm best. I'm the best. I'm the best. <laughs> These motherfuckers can't find me, for real. I'll be hiding, bro, in the best spots, bro. Best nah, spots. I'll I scare the fuck out of fuck. people. Like, it depend on the day, you know? Some days I play, some days I'm like, bro, I'm just trying to get my nut off and just... Yeah, I used, to, I used to fucking... Uh, I used to ride my bike, bro, and I used to put the fucking, you know, the, the Pepsi cans and put it in the oh, back of my yeah. tire, and it'll make it sound like a motorcycle. Like a fucking dirt bike. And, and just your like, fat ass would be sweating your <laughs> fucking gooch off. Yeah, That shit's bro. hard as fuck to pedal. We used, there was a point in time when <laughs> I used to be a fucking little stunt devil, bro. Me and my friend, we used to have the little plastic ramps. Oh would, yeah, and you would ride them, you know. And you see a lot of people fuck up. I didn't. I didn't do it because I didn't separate them too far. Nah, <laughs> you know yeah, what I nah. mean. We and, fucked up a few times. Some niggas got hurt, hurt, bro. We we're no. like, I'm not doing that shit no more. There was, <laughs> there <laughs> no was a girl real. I've seen, bro. A girl that did it. And she fell in front of me and she scraped her knee and like fell. And it was kind of funny at first, but it, it it was funny when she was in the air. But when she landed and she started crying and no, she was I'm not like, gonna oh. lie. If you just scrape your knee and you fall funny, I'm still gonna laugh. No, I was laughing. I'm gonna laugh. I was laughing, but, but no, nah, there was a few times I felt, like I felt bad. No, we'd no. play ball at the skate park and shit, and there was some kids that got hurt, hurt. <laughs> like these niggas are fucking trying to do BMX tricks and shit, thinking that they're fucking Tony Hawk or some, whatever. Some people were good. Yeah, some people weren't. <laughs> <laughs> some people weren't. You Bro, know, there was it wasn't a few kids. There was a kid that like broke his back. There was another kid that like broke his fucking like collarbone or some stupid shit like yeah and i have to shut down the whole park now i'm like yo y'all some selfish motherfuckers <laughs> the basketball court has nothing to do with over there yeah it's like i don't know like would you get sued for that <laughs> i mean like you have to i don't remember signing anything being going in i that mean park. i don't know bro you probably can it all depends but if a, your kid like they yeah, got cameras so if they fucking see you over here trying to hit a fucking 30 foot jump they're gonna be like Bro, yeah, no helmet. No, bro, in fact, yeah, they'd be like, nah, dog, nah. it's your fault. Yeah, I just put cameras and shit. It like sucks, that. but it, it really is your fault. Yeah. For sure. Fuck it. But listen, man, joyriding as a kid is another fucking example of what not to do as a kid, right? I remember there was a few times. I remember my boy Juan came over one day, man. My boy Juan from Trio, bro. Shout out to him. This thing came over we were playing the Xbox. It was when Halo was out, bro. Like the second Halo or some stupid shit had come out. He came over, we we're playing it. And then out of nowhere, his mom's fucking pissed at him. So we gotta fucking get the car what? and take him home. But my mom was asleep. Oh and my sister fucking in the other room, and I'm like, I'm not asking her shit. 
So I just grabbed the keys and we go. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> and she woke up. Nah, bro. My mom always noticed when something was off with her car, bro. She'd ask questions like asking, like a- acting dumb, but she knew. She always fucking knew. Parents aren't stupid, bro. Like, parents know when you touch their shit, when you move their shit. You know what I mean? It's like. Yeah, no, nah, they know. Like, I would go, I'll go over to my mom's house and she's like, you always fucking leave fucking clues. You know that? You yeah, my mom always told me that yeah. shit. Like, you be the worst fucking criminal ever. You yeah. get fucking caught in two seconds. For real. Like, you be fucking, like, leaving crumbs and shit, like, of, like, certain, like, <laughs> snacks and shit. I'll be like, man, she'll never know. I'll just take her snacks. She'll never know. There's She's a crumb like, here, yeah. crumb there, yeah, a crumb fucking, in my bed. There's a bag that you left. There's a fucking, you forgot to wash the dishes on certain shit. It's like, what the fuck? You fucking, what the fuck? Nah, you suck. Yeah, yeah, yeah like, for real. for real. Moms, man. Moms. What Moms are different, bro, but... Yeah, man, guys, look, don't go joyriding. <laughs> Some people get in a lot of trouble for that stupid shit. For mm-hmm. real. Everybody ain't blessed enough to just make it back home. Nah, for you real. I mean? like, going like 600 miles an hour down the fucking street and shit. <laughs> the fuck? Like, I don't get these we bikers, bro. We didn't give bro. a fuck, bro. We didn't give a fuck. Nah, I don't know. I, I don't mean, care. bro, we got we watching fucking Fast and Furious growing up. You know yeah, I mean? that was fun as fuck. I remember that. Like, Before they made like... Seven more fucking movies. No, nah, no. Nah. Fast and Furious. Too Fast, Too Furious was probably my favorite one. Well, no. Nah, I, I want to say my, it was my favorite one until Tokyo Drift came out. After Tokyo Drift, they needed to stop. <laughs> no cap, to, bro. Nah, like, yeah. I, I was like, bro, what the fuck is this? I don't know. Like, I think they were just planning to fucking kill Paul Walker and then continue to make money. I don't think they... Bro, that makes no sense. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That makes no sense. Some Hollywood but, devil shit. Uh, I think they would have made more money with him being in the movies. Mm -hmm. I think that's why a lot of it, like now they have to do other shit. They have to fucking be in flying cars and be in space and shit. Yeah, like doing all this extra shit because Paul ain't there. So you got to keep your mind off of that. Yeah. It's Paul, dog. Yeah, I was watching an old video of him, man. That's crazy, bro. He's talented. Yeah, he was was a good actor, bro. He was a good actor. And And then a long name. Without you, my, my friend. And I'll tell you all about it when I see you again. And wow, bro. Round of applause, man. Round of applause. When I see you again, Paul, we'll see you again, buddy, you in know, that fucking GTI. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know why people like me? Why is that, my friend? It's because I'm a bad boy. And I'm <laughs> a good singer. I'm you're an good, angel, but I'm you're a devil. You're a good singer and you're a bad boy. I'm an, angel, right. I'm an angel, but I'm a devil. I'll tell you something. I'm Bob. a demon, but I'm a god. I be spitting like I'm from the mob. Hey, this guy, this guy over here, round of applause to him. He actually found a word around him. I thought real. he was going to say he fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was too out to think about it. But I'll tell you something, man. Yeah, nah, That's being true. a fucking bad boy, bro, it's crazy. Like, some of the finest women I ever met in my life. Some of the baddest women I ever met in my life, bro. They like the bad boys, man. Bad boys. And y'all are the worst fucking influences. Nah, for real. You'll ma- I'm telling you, bro. You'll make a nigga rob somebody just because it makes you wet. Oh, my God. Nah, like, she's like, oh, my God. He does fucking heroin. He does fucking coke. <laughs> Oh my God, he's fucking oh amazing. God. He lives on the edge. Hey, he lives on the edge. He be fucking riding motorcycles and fucking breaking his leg every other week. He hit his head last w- fucking year. That shit's fucking amazing. No, you know, it's bro. like it's like nah, bro. It's, it's fucking like, stupid. Nah, they, their fucking nipples get hard for like really yeah, crazy it's like shit. They get wet for the dumbest shit. Yeah. They be like, like, oh my God, tell me again how many times you wrecked your bike. How many times? Like, how many times you got arrested? I almost died five fucking times, and you think it's fucking hot. You got arrested 30 times? Like, <laughs> I think I got to fuck you 30 times now. You know what I mean? It's like, fuck. <laughs> shit, man. What can you do, it's bro? It's the stupidest shit I, ever, bro. So, guys, if you want to really, really want to get laid, catch like 30 fucking charges. Yeah. Fucking don't take care of your kids and fucking just yeah. live your life on the edge and do a lot of heroin. <laughs> And you'll be fucking fine. Yeah, you'll be all right. You'll end up in a nice fucking crib. Yeah, you know yeah. I mean? You'll be in a nice crib. You fucking, you'll fucking cool you'll be fucking riding around. You don't gotta pay for shit. You, you, <laughs> you can go on cruise lines. You go fucking cruising all over the fucking world. Go to Mexico. Fucking do coke over there if you want. I heard yeah, it's nice. Fuck it. 
I think they got the pink shit. Yeah, bro. So, man, I, I wish I had a fucking sugar mama, bro. That would be fucking dope. Yeah, bro. I think I've talked about it like 500 times on yeah. here. But I I could have had one and I just, <laughs> I couldn't do it, bro. She, she was had, rich, rich. She was big. She was rich. Big, too. No, nah, she wasn't big. She was just ugly as fuck. <laughs> she was like an older fucking Asian lady. She did not look good at all. But she had like an Aston Martin, a fucking Bentley. Her monthly fucking electricity bill was like eight grand. And eight. she used to come in and pay it every month. That's how we knew she was rich. I'd be like, Oh, yeah. Damn. I think you told me about her. Yeah. My boss was like, Bro. If I wasn't married, I would, I would be. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, yeah. bro, you better get that Bentley for the weekend, bro. Nah, for real. Nah, it's just, <laughs> they're out there. It's just not like the best looking, you know what Yeah, I, mean? I can't do it. Yeah, there's reasons not why like they're that. paying for it. Yeah. You know? <laughs> That's a fact. It's like, damn, Because the good looking girls, you don't got to pay for shit. She can pull any guy she I'm wants. I'm have to take a whole blue chew and a half, bro, just to fucking get my shit hard for you. Yeah, bro. God. Holy fuck. That's rough. That's a rough situation when you can't get up. If, Bro, if I don't find you attractive to the point where I can't get up, I'm going to just leave. I don't know. Sometimes when I'm having sex, I think of sad shit just once in a while. <laughs> like a fucking like dead puppy or some shit. And then or a it fucking, fucking makes you limp. Yeah, just one. Like, <laughs> all I do is close my eyes for two seconds. And I, it's like. No, nah, that's not fucking. That's that Henny dick, bro. Yeah. When you be fucking laying down the bottom. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You be just. Damn near Rocky dumbass to sleep. Bro, you drink that <laughs> bottle, bro. That show will vortex you into another fucking dimension, bro. Or you just turn into a fucking demon. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, yeah. Dead when ass. I get at it in a certain level, bro, it's like, yeah, no, nah, it's like something comes over me and I'm gonna fucking wreck your shit. Yeah, I'm gonna you know just I mean? fucking like, take this car and drive it off the fucking bridge, huh? No, I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I would never do that. That's fucking That's scary. That's my worst fear, actually. Every time bro, I drive man, over a fucking every time bridge, I, I always picture that. I'm like, what would I do <laughs> yeah. if this shit just started falling over right I now? Know, I know what I would do. I would fucking. What would you do? Because I always imagine myself being trapped in the fucking cabin, not being able to open the doors because of the pressure, right? That's my worst fear. So when I'm falling. You're going to open I'm, the door? No, I'm just going to press the window once and it's going to open automatically. I'm going to let the fucking thing fall. You know that it's going to sink like three times quicker. So if your fat ass for any reason gets caught on that window. Oh, and I can't fucking get out. You're going to be at the bottom twice as fast. And I got gators (laughs) gators going after my ass at the same time. Either way. No, but that's not that bad of an idea. Either way, it's fucked. It's it's fucked. You got bull sharks in there, too, because bull sharks. Yeah. You can't, it's bull sharks, it's alligators. You can't see shit because it's fucking brown water, bro. Like, Ugh, yeah. it's nasty, murky b- water. You can't see two feet in front of you. Yeah. Like, that, yeah. I'd I'll, shit myself, bro. Yeah. I'd pucker up. No, nah, I'll pucker up and float there like a log. <laughs> <laughs> just go. <laughs> just go with the current. If I, uh, hopefully, it just keeps out of the my flow. Eyes. Hopefully, somebody out here fishing will fucking save me. <laughs> nah, for real. Because you can't panic. You got to just float there. Because yeah, if you panic, I you, mean, no, you, you get tired. I'm getting to shore. That's for sure. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'm, yeah, I'm swimming until I can. It ain't like I'm stuck in the middle of the ocean or some shit, nigga. I'm right there. Like, yeah, you're in a river. They've been, pull- <laughs> they've been pulling out some fucking gators, man. Big nah, ones. they got a lot. There's a of picture gators. of this gator that fucking they just caught not too long ago. It's not even a gator. It was a crocodile, but it wasn't here. It was somewhere else. Like, I, I don't know the location, but I saw the picture, bro, and it was fucking huge. It Yo, was, people don't bro. understand that gators or crocodiles, bro, they live in salt water and fresh water. It's re- that's ridiculous. And so no, they it, could it, fucking literally catch you swimming in like the ocean if they're close enough. That's scary. That's scary. And yeah, there was a video, bro, of a guy swimming away from one. You remember that? I showed you that. Yeah, it was a guy. I got to show you. It's ridiculous. It's old, but he was swimming away and the guy's on top of a bridge recording him. And the fucking croc was like 10 times bigger than him. Maybe like five times. I'm exaggerating. Bro, but listen. It was man. huge. Like, and oh, it was swimming uh, fast. <laughs> Look, man, we're humans and we got we got our brain. That's what makes us human and that's what like makes us be able to do a lot of different things. Yeah. But if you're it's just you, your swimming trunks, you're stuck in a fucking river, and it's you against an alligator or you against a crocodile, you lost. Sorry, bro. Yeah. Unless you like poke it in the eye and you, if you have a knife, if you have a knife, you have a way better chance of surviving. Yeah, facts. But <clears throat> chances are, bro, you're fucked. Chances are, you're fucked. They're way stronger than what you think. They swim way faster than what you think. Yeah, you I know mean, what I'm saying. Apparently, like, apparently, people go missing all the time. Like in yeah, villages and shit like that. 
Bro, if the crocodile is big enough, they're just going to snatch you. Honestly, what they'll do is they'll snatch you underwater and just, like, drown you. That's what that's what they do. They drown you first, Drive, and then they eat you. And you're on the fucking river, the small-ass canoes that they use. They'll be able to fucking knock that shit over. You fall off the fucking boat, and it's a wrap. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> they'll just hit that shit with his tail, do a little whiplash. Bro. Yeah, bro. And, and, there's and, and, there's some crocodiles that are recorded to be like fucking thirty feet long and shit. You know, they live by certain villages and shit. People walk like see them and stuff. Like by now, bro. Like you should know. Like people should know where not to fucking go. People do, still do it. I'm gonna go over here and wash these fucking underwears. This is where the buffalo come and get the drink sack. Why the fuck are you there? Facts, you ever bro. seen the buffalo going in for the water? And next thing you know, a and giant leave, ass bro. fucking bro, yeah. that shit's gone in like three seconds, bro. Nah, facts, yeah, them them shits get caught, bro. It's fucked. That it's shit, over. that shit grabs my dog like that old man. You seen that video? <laughs> that fucking the old man jumps in the water with a cigar in his mouth. And he yeah, fucking, he grabbed the, it was the a gator. gator. Yeah, it wasn't a big. It don't gator. matter, bro. It was a tiny. It don't gator. matter. Yeah, if it was a big gator, I'm sorry, bro. You. All right, Peter, my dog. No, for real. Think about that being a 10-foot gator. Are you going to go get Remy? He grabs Remy. Man, I'm going to shoot in the water until I can't no more. I'll probably kill Remy on accident. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to kill both of y'all. Make sure y'all go out peacefully. Everybody, you fucking dead. <laughs> nah, for real. You ain't going to eat my dog, bro. I'm going to kill you before you do that. I swear to God, bro. You ain't going to eat my dog, bro. Nah, bro. Your dog would get eight. Your dog would be eight. My yeah, dog would be eight. Yeah, my dog. Like, there's certain, with certain alligators, it'd be, you could win, you could jump, jump in there, or maybe you could shoot it, but what of certain alligators, bitch? What would you do if your dog just fucking, like, came out the water, and then the alligator just died, flipped over, and just and the dog came out? You'd be like... <laughs> like your dog killed the gator? Yeah. <laughs> yo, that's gang gang for nah, life, I'll bro. i like, yo, Remy, I ain't fucking with I'll you, like, bro. Yo, dog, I knew he was hefty for a reason, bro. Yeah, he's heavy. That nigga that's a lot of meat. Fucking paws. That on motherfucker him. can feed a whole family with Remy, and he's only like fucking. Nah, that nigga got no bones or no fucking meat. It's all bones. It's all head fucking. <laughs> it's all skull <laughs> and fucking paws. I swear. And shoulders. Yeah, it's just. You could. Yeah, that's kind of. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, just, I'm thinking about me. <laughs> How would my dog be fucking shredded? That's fucking gross, bro. Yeah, bro. Nah, facts. That's a big fact. Yeah, bro. Well. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. We appreciate everybody that's rocking, liking, sharing, subscribing. Don't forget, hit the like button, leave a comment, go down in the description, get yourself a little bit of merch. It's hoodie season coming up. Get your dogs a fucking hoodie. You know what I'm saying? Don't leave them out in the cold. Don't be a fucking piece of shit. Don't right? do it. Yeah. Don't do that. Don't do that. No, we love you. We appreciate you. And we'll catch you on the next one. Peace and love. Peace and love. Peace and love. See you.